Let's take a family photo. <laughs> Can you say freedom? Freedom! <laughs> freedom! Yeah, that's, that's all I needed. Hello. Hello! Hi, I'm Lauren from England. Alright, my name is Rowena from Scotland. What's the crack? I'm Owen from Ireland. <laughs> nice to meet you! Hi. Nice, to, nice meet to meet you! you. Rowena. Owen, nice to meet you. <laughs> I have oh. a lot of friends from Ireland, from Dublin, mm, you do? and my mum's side of my family is actually Scottish. Oh, so, so you're like right in between. The yeah. Both. Wow. <laughs> yeah, like in Ireland, obviously we get a lot of English media as well. So I, mean, yeah. I grew up listening to the English accent as well. A lot of my dad's family live in England, so we go to England a lot. And I've never been to Ireland. Sorry. You got a car. But I actually <laughs> love the Irish accent. For me, the Scottish accent is like warm. Okay. And yeah, because it like reminds me of my family, so it's like really Aww. always like good feeling. It does it kind of have a happy sort of yeah. vibe to it. Well, like Scotland has a lot of different accents, but I think in general the Scottish accent's a little bit rough. Rough but mm. fun. When you meet a Scottish person, it just feels like oh, it's banter. Yeah. It's fun. You can get along with that person. You can be friends with that person mm -hmm. really easily. The Irish accent is just like happy and very bubbly. We have so many accents in Ireland as well. So it's hard to say what the Irish accent is, but you know, every city has its own thing. Mm. Different slang, different words that go. So, yeah, yeah, for me, the Irish accent is just really, really friendly. It just feels like they're just always very happy. It's the beer. It's the, <laughs> <laughs> it's the Guinness. It's all the Guinness. It makes us feel good. Guinness. England has so many accents. Though. Yeah, it's ridiculous. True. So many accents. I love English accents because they're all so different. Mm -hmm. um, also, a lot of my family lives in Newcastle, so Ooh. a lot of my cousins are just Geordies. So I love their accents. Yeah. In England, we say butter or butter. In Scotland, we would say butter. And in Ireland, we say butter. Or we'd also say butter. But butter. butter. They're all pretty similar. <laughs> Depending where you're butter. from. I think yours is kind of similar. Yeah, I think. Butter. Yeah. I know in, in Ireland we kind of have this soft T sound, so it mm. kind of it turns into like butter instead of the hard butter, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I feel like in Scotland we, we tend to cut out the T's, yeah. so instead of butter, it's just butter. Yeah, we kind of do the same, depending where you're from. Yeah. Same. It's the ER sound that's quite different. Ireland definitely has the harder R sound. You actually butter. say the R. In Scotland we roll our R's a lot, like R, like R, like, <laughs> like a pirate. Roll. <laughs> like a pirate. <laughs> <laughs> but I feel like when Scottish people speak, you can almost hear their tongue rolling. Um, in England, we say lock. In Scotland, we say loch. In Ireland, we say loch. Loch is a really Scottish word though. Yeah. Because it means lake. lake. Mm -hmm. Loch Ness, for example. Yeah. Loch. And that's a really Scottish sound. <sighs> yeah, the, <sighs> the Irish language also has that too. Exactly. I feel like Scouse people would say loch. Oh, oh really? yeah, that, oh, yeah. That's pretty good. <laughs> Um, in England, we say twirl. In Scotland, we say twirl. In Ireland, we say twirl. Again, the I think the, the sound. or sound, yeah. uh -huh. where England kind of skips over the or sound, we go full on twirl. 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 And you know there's like the twirl. chocolate bar? Uh-huh. Yeah, twirl. exactly. I love that. Twirl. 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 I love twirl. Twirl. <laughs> oh, it's so difficult. Um, in England, we say coupon. In Scotland, we say coupon. In Ireland, we say coupon. <laughs> coupon. 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 It's Such kind of like got an A coupon. sound. It's like it? A N. We hardly use that word, I feel like. We use vouchers more, right? Voucher, Voucher yes. yeah. Vouchers more of a. The more common yeah. word instead of coupon. In England, we say tube. In Scotland, we say tube. In Ireland, we say tube. 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 Yeah, it's like a CH. That's a yeah, long, we're similar. Long yeah. O sound. Scotland's more short, short. and rough. Tube. Chub. Oh, chub. 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 Like you said, you're wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Brown like, but friendly. Yeah, the T-U always. My American friends always mock me for saying chew. Yeah, we always C-H like, yeah. the T yeah. at the start. I think for the Scottish accent, it's just a lot more rough, the beginning syllable. So instead of T, it's more just ch, ch. Yeah. In England, we say potato. In Scotland, we say potato. In Ireland, we don't say potato. <laughs> <laughs> we just say Potato. <laughs> that sounded the what? same to me. No, I'm, I'm trying not to be the stereotype. Oh, potato. but sometimes in Scotland we say tatties as well. Mint and tatties just means you're having mint and potatoes for dinner. Tatties is a very common word yeah. for potato tatties. as well. Otherwise, you just cut the teas out. Potato. And potatoes are great. I love baked potatoes. You can do everything with potatoes. Mash them, boil yes. them, stick them in a stew. Fry them. them. <laughs> exactly. Fry them, roast. I love them. I'm so hungry. Um, in England, we say tonight. In Scotland, we say tonight. 
in Ireland, we say tonight. Ooh, very pronounced. Is that it? At tonight. the end. Tonight. tonight. The soft T again. Tonight. Yeah. Tonight. Oh. Yeah. Tonight. Oh, like that's that. really nice. I like that. Tonight. Yeah. Let's have a beer tonight. Oh, I like that. A pint tonight. You're gonna cut off the end. Do you wanna come over tonight? Tonight. It's all just like very short. It is. I like it. But I feel like when people come to Scotland for the first time, they have a really difficult time understanding the words because people cut out the tea so much. Mm. I feel like if there was like a really fast, long sentence, I'd be like, huh. Mm. And then you add, in, you add in some slang and it's just like. <laughs> <laughs> Um, in England, we say photo. In Scotland, we say photo. In Ireland, we say photo. The tea is okay. so soft, it's, yeah, but it's there. Really, it's yeah, there. It's there. It's so like delicate. This much. I guess the O sound is a little more O. Yeah, it's more O. It's, yeah, photo. It's a no tea, no tea yeah. sound. Photo. Take a photo. Photo. <laughs> um, in England, we say herb. In Scotland, we say herb. Oh, herb, herb, herb. Some people say herb. Some people say herb. I guess it depends on the people. And in Ireland, we say herb. What do you say, herb or herb? I say herb. No H then? Yeah. So it's more like. That might just be me, though. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> in England, we say ballet. In Scotland, we say ballet. In Ireland, we say ballet. It's actually Ooh, quite similar. similar. I don't think there's anywhere you could really call it. Exactly. Especially because it's a French word. I guess so, yeah. Originally, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So, ballet. 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 Maybe tonight? Tonight potato. and potato. potato. I like the T sound at the end tonight. from the Irish accent tonight. It's really soft. This is just kind of like trails off. Yeah. Tonight. It's romantic. Nice. Do you want to come over tonight? Oh. <laughs> come over tonight, we have a drink. Photo was good. Let's take a family photo. <laughs> Can you say freedom? Freedom. <laughs> freedom. Yeah, that's, that's all I needed. So today we compared the accents of Scotland, England and Ireland. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. Thank bye. you. Bye. Thank you. Bye.